Hey guys! In this video, we're going to look at the top 5 laptops under $800 available on the market today. We made this list based on our own opinion, research, and customer reviews. We've considered the quality, features, and values when narrowing down the best choices possible. If you want more information and updated pricing on the products mentioned, be sure to check the links in the description box below. So, here are the top 5 best laptops under $800. The fifth product on our list is the Acer Aspire 5. The Acer Aspire is a budget laptop designed to be used for general work and leisure needs. This includes things like browsing YouTube, watching movies, and writing up work reports. With a 15.6-inch Full HD 1920x1080 display, it's fair to say you'll get high-quality viewing no matter what you're doing. Some consider 1920x1080 displays to be outdated due to the widespread introduction of 1440p and 4K monitors. But there is nothing to complain about when you're paying this little for a well-rounded laptop. This laptop also features Vega 3 graphics. Be under no illusion, this is not a laptop for gaming, and you'd struggle to play many modern games even at mid-level graphics settings. However, if you're looking for a laptop that can play videos with a good standard of graphics, then you can't fault this system. Its pros are, it is great value for money. The Ryzen CPU comes with a fast clock speed, and the boot time is around 15 seconds thanks to its internal SSD. Its cons are, it comes with Microsoft 10S, which you need to upgrade to a full version for proper Windows functionality. The Acer Aspire 5 is an excellent value for money laptop designed for students, people who need to work on the go, and or those who need a basic laptop for entertainment on the go. It features fast boot times and high-quality graphics for quite a low price point. Up next in the fourth place is the HP Touchscreen. The HP Touchscreen was built with simplicity in mind. Featuring a small 1366 by 768 monitor, it is easy to travel with and store no matter where you go. Don't be fooled by this laptop's small size though. It bolsters 8GB of DDR4 RAM meaning this compact contraption packs a powerful punch in terms of multitasking and using multiple tabs while using a web browser. Also featured is 128GB of storage thanks to its onboard SSD, which also happens to increase startup load times dramatically. This in turn boosts efficiency by lowering the time it usually takes for a laptop to boot up. Trust us, we've all suffered through those unbearable load up times before. In terms of the CPU power at your disposal, this is all determined by the Intel Core i3 1005G1 processor, which has a clock speed of up to 3.4 GHz, which is more than enough for the task the HP touchscreen was designed to accomplish. Instead of having a dedicated graphics card, you get Intel's built-in Ultra HD graphics as part of your processor's capabilities. Again, if you do not intend to game with this efficient machine, then these UHD graphics should be more than enough for whatever you want to throw at it. If you're going to be using the HP touchscreen for work, then you'll be happy to find out that there is a built-in HP TrueVision HD webcam. This means having an excellent quality of video capture if you have to take classes or meetings online. Its pros are, the 8GB of DDR4 RAM is fantastic for multitasking and a great quality webcam which is suitable for online meetings. Its cons are, the drivers it comes with are outdated and may require numerous updates. The HP touchscreen is slightly more expensive than the Acer Aspire, but is smaller and more compact, so it may be more suitable for you if you travel a lot and really need to make the most of the space you have available to yourself. Nonetheless, it is still a good laptop for someone on a budget who needs one for general purposes still haven't found a laptop under $800 that meets your needs? Well, keep watching, because we have more lined up for you. Meanwhile, if this is your first time visiting our channel, be sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon to receive notifications of our next videos. The third product on our list is the Lenovo IdeaPad. This machine is exactly what you'd expect from a budget laptop. It features an astonishing 256GB of SSD storage. While this may not be impressive to some of you who have large desktop PCs or more expensive laptops, it is an incredibly large amount of SSD storage considering the price of this laptop. 
the AMD Ryzen 5 3500U processor is generally worth considering for those multitaskers out there, being able to handle multiple processes at once with relative ease. If you couple this processor with 8GB of DDR4 RAM, then you've got a powerful combination. You should be expecting fast load times and no significant slowdowns if you're working on multiple things at once. For those of you who often get frustrated at your laptop battery running low quite quickly, then you could be in luck. One of Lenovo IdeaPad's features is the option to switch efficiently between battery saver mode and max performance mode, depending on what needs you want to prioritize. Depending on how seriously you take privacy, Lenovo may have come up with a feature you didn't even know you needed. Lots of people often tape a piece of paper over the webcams because they are often worried about people spying in on them. Lenovo has built in a physical shutter for your webcam, meaning you can cover it up at will to give you peace of mind. Its pros are, it is great for video editing and browsing thanks to the combination of RAM and CPU. And it is also light and compact despite how large it looks. Its cons are, when max performance battery is on, the battery life drains relatively quickly. Lenovo has come up with an excellent laptop for those who may need a little extra juice out of a budget laptop without having to fork out more money for this higher price ranges. You get a significant amount of RAM and plenty of storage for whatever needs you may have. The second product on our list is the HP 14 inch. The HP 14 inch is effectively a beefier version of the HP touchscreen we showed you earlier. It features the same screen size at 1366 by 768 but don't let this put you off. Compared to our last three products, this laptop is powered by 16 gigabytes of DDR4 RAM. For a laptop such as this, you could even argue that this much RAM is overkill for the things you'd be doing on it. Expect multitasking ability at the absolute next level, which you'd probably come to expect on a laptop pushing $1,000 rather than $600. So it is definitely safe to say you're already getting bang for your buck. The great deal doesn't stop there either. You get 512GB of SSD storage, which would be great if you often download or edit large files for work or other purposes. In reality, you'll probably struggle to fill all the storage up, but feel free to try your best. Also featuring is a 10-hour battery life, depending on how much you're doing on this laptop. If you're using it for work purposes or just to browse the internet, then you should be able to get a relatively good amount of time out of the HP 14-inch before having to charge up again. With an AMD 3.2 GHz CPU and the aforementioned 16 GB of RAM, you'll be getting a powerful laptop indeed. Its pros are, it is relatively lightweight for its size and hardware, and it has fast boot speeds and can handle almost any work task you throw at it. However, its cons are, the mouse pad can be slightly tricky, and you may need to buy a USB mouse to make up for this. This laptop is excellent for those of you who are willing to spend more towards the $800 range due to the sheer amount of RAM, storage, and CPU power you're going to get from this product. If you normally end up doing tasks that require a lot of CPU and RAM, then this laptop could be the one for you. Before we reveal number one, be sure to check out the description below for the newest deals on each of these items and be sure to subscribe if you want to stay up to date on the best products on the market. Finally, our top laptop under $800 is the Asus VivoBook. The Asus VivoBook is effectively one of the newest budget laptops on the market with some of the latest hardware you could possibly buy for this kind of price. Throughout this review, you've heard us talk about SSDs and storage all the time, but we promise you that it doesn't get better than this. Featured in this laptop is 512GB NVMe SSD. We'll briefly explain to those of you who aren't quite aware of what an NVMe SSD is or how it differs from a typical SSD. An NVMe SSD is a tiny storage chip on your motherboard. Not only does it save space hardware-wise, but it is also astonishingly faster than regular SSD. Expect boot times of less than 10 seconds. That's how fast we're talking. Not only do you get the latest in storage technology, but you also get the latest 10th generation Intel Core i5-1035G1 CPU with a max clock speed of 3.6 GHz. If you're willing to spend around $600, then let us tell you now that you're going to be getting the latest in budget laptop technology. Unlike some other laptops we've mentioned, the Asus VivoBook comes with the full version of Windows 10 rather than Windows 10S, which requires further upgrading to the full version. 
you're going to get powerful hardware coupled with full functionality for a truly competitive price in today's laptop market. Its pros are swift loading times thanks to the NVMe SSD, and it comes with four USB ports, so there is plenty of scope for external pieces of hardware. Its cons are the screen quality isn't the best for gaming or other high fidelity processes. If you have plenty of money to spend on an excellent all-rounder laptop, then the Asus VivaBook is arguably the one for you. It features an incredibly modern and powerful SSD and CPU, and it will definitely be able to handle almost all processes you may need to use except for gaming. That's all for now. Thanks for watching. If we helped you out in any way, please hit the like and subscribe button. We'll see you guys in the next videos.